You told me more than once to show you my intention. My brain gets blocked at times, but now somehow I'll give you my attention. You've got to know that I. Welcome back to a weekly refresh. So today I have lots of cleaning to do. I'll probably throw in a grocery haul as well as some meal prep. I'm gonna do this over the course of two days. So that's the thing, like you guys don't feel like you have to do all of this in one day. If you need to spread your reset out over the course of a couple of days, um, by all means do that. Most of the time I try to do it all in one day just for filming purposes. This time I really need to just spread it out because the kids are home doing school. They're doing like an AB schedule at school right now where they only go to school a couple days a week and then the rest of the time they're at home doing schoolwork. So I'm gonna have to spread my time out. Um, but right now I need to focus on getting the bed sheets stripped and into the washer i also need to clean my room it's such a disaster it's going to take me a little while to clean and it's getting raised nap time so i'm gonna hold off on that for now so she can take her nap but in the meantime i will get the beds stripped and then i also need to groom pom-pom today that's why i've not gotten ready yet because usually after I cut her hair I have to take a shower myself because I'm just covered in dog hair so I hadn't even bothered getting ready also I wanted to thank FabFitFun for sponsoring today's video we are gonna rewind time real quick and I'll show you guys the unboxing and everything I got so let's do that real quick and then we'll get into today's reset so this is the 2021 fall FabFitFun box. FabFitFun is one of my favorite subscription boxes to get because you get some really good stuff for a great price. So it's a seasonal subscription box with full size fashion, beauty, fitness, and lifestyle products valuing up to $300. But members actually get the box for $49.99. So that is a really great deal. And then if you use my code at Kelly's Corner, you will get an additional $10 off making your box $39.99. If you're a current member or you're new to FabFitFun, you can customize up to four products in your box with the rest being curated by FabFitFun. Or if you choose the annual membership, you can customize your entire box. And if you just want to be surprised, then FabFitFun will curate your whole box for you. So the membership is really flexible and they have tons of flash sales each year where you can shop top brands at up to 70% off. They're continuously adding guidelines to their curation process so that products never contain harmful ingredients. This box has an amazing value. Often you can get the whole box for less than what one of the products inside cost which is crazy i love that because there's no way i could afford to buy all of these items individually and i also wanted to say that the fabfitfun subscription box is available in the us the uk and all canada right guys i got everything unboxed and out of the package so you can see everything a little bit better um the first thing i'll show you is this little mini dutch oven i'm really excited for this it's so cute and i love the colors um, so I got that and then this white and gray buffalo check hat that will be really pretty in the fall time a day that I'm not feeling like doing my hair or just having a bad hair day in general I can throw that on um, this little tray it actually will um, close up and become like like that but um, you can store like jewelry or whatever you want this little lunch sack here I'm thinking this will be something really good to keep in the diaper bag put like cookies or whatever in there it is reusable so got that something else I'm excited for is this backpack it's just a tan with cheetah print um, backpack it's got a pocket here on the back it unzips so lots of storage um, you've got this pocket here on the front uh, water bottle pockets or for your cell phone also got this cheese board I'm excited about that that would make a really good like charcuterie board for the kids um, days that they're having to do school work at home uh, we can set this out with a variety of fruits and cheese and whatever else they want to snack on so that will be perfect um, I also got this bath gel uh, islands of Italy I've already smelled it, it smells amazing last but not least this 
detoxifying mud mask. It's pumpkin and ginger. So that'll be really good to incorporate into a pamper routine. So that was really fun to unbox and see everything that I got. That's the thing that I love about subscription boxes like this. It's like a surprise coming in the mail because you don't know exactly what you're getting. Um, but I love everything that came in my box and I really think you guys would enjoy this subscription box too. It's a $300 value. It comes out four times a year but you only pay $49.99 and if you use the code Kelly's Corner that will get you an additional $10 off making the box only $39.99 so click that link down below use the code and get started so thank you so much to FabFitFun for sponsoring today's video I told you every single time don't you worry so y'all have to tell me and hopefully I'm not alone here but I can go weeks without washing mine or the kids bedding as awful as that is to admit but it happens um, but my point here is that as soon as I do one of the kids gets sick with a stomach bug the very next day and they usually get sick on their bedding it happens every single time and I end up having to rewash so tell me if that happens to you too go ahead and start grooming palm but I really need to wait until my toddler is down for her nap or it'll be a disaster so to kill a little bit more time until she's ready to go down I'm gonna go ahead and wash up the dishes and also a fun fact here in case you guys ever wonder about my mom I know some of you are probably thinking that she doesn't help but we share a lot of the household chores and we make it a team effort but on days that I'm filming, I literally will tell her not to do any of the cleaning. Um, but normally it's a team effort, so I just wanted to say that in case anyone was wondering. a little Dutch oven from the FabFitFun box uh, the night before to make grits and it was perfect. We've also used it to make pasta sauce. I can't wait to do some other things in it. I'd love to try a dessert in the oven or maybe a pot pie.
obsessing over dress when I split Shoot me a blink, I'm dying from boredom So now I can start grooming Palm. I just lay a towel out onto the kitchen floor and she cooperates pretty well. Um, a lot of you guys have commented on how well she behaves during her bath and such. And I have to say that I had to earn her trust both with bathing and grooming. She knows the ropes and what to expect. So she'll usually cooperate and let me do what I need to do. The only time she really wants to fight me is when I start on her feet. She's very skittish about them and I'm not really sure why. I've never hurt her to my knowledge, but I think a lot of it is due to old age because she wasn't always like that. Getting older, her feet might just bother her and it's not comfortable. So I usually have to take my time with that, but as far as everything else, she does really well. And as I said, I had to earn her trust with it. She wasn't always keen about getting groomed and bathed, but over time, as we did it more and more, it reassured her of exactly how the process goes and that she'll be just fine. So, and I'll also talk to her throughout the process. Like if I notice she's getting antsy, I'll talk to her and rub her just to relax her. I've always groomed her though. I got her when she was just a couple of months old. So she was still very tiny and she's now 11. And I can only remember twice I took her to be groomed. Kind of simple, kind of wishful about things. And you're kind of simple, but like a pistol, you fire. Sometimes you get under my skin like a lover, and sometimes you don't wanna come back because you'd rather stay out with another. Talking to strangers and make out spontaneously Now I'm so tired of hearing all your stories About the drunk guides bragging and the glory You're such a nice guy when you're not just talking about yourself And the way of how you dwell, I get it Oh, I'm so tired
clothes. I was able to get my shower, so now I can finish everything I need to do, starting with switching the sheets to the dryer and getting the next load on. Usually when I'm washing bed sheets, I have to keep it flowing. <laughs> so here's what my bathroom looks like. I need to tidy that and then do a thorough deep clean. So you don't wanna be with me, but you miss me as soon as it's over. You name that enough screen, but you never call when you're sober. You say you don't like the games, but you play me like there's no tomorrow. You should know. You guys will have to tell me if it's the same for you but I probably get 20 spam calls a day that's a bit of an exaggeration but it certainly feels like 20 <laughs> I'll leave this steamer in the description box, but I love it specifically for this. It's one thing to spray and wipe down the toilet, but there's just something so satisfying about using the steam cleaner on it. I feel like it gets 100% clean. I usually have to go back with a towel and wipe around it because it does put off a lot of water. Never could have been Thinking I would know what the future bring All the highs and lows Said I'm gonna win Though the world might spin Now I'm sitting here like I'm no one It rains down on me All the phone calls I'm ignoring See, I'm a mess Just trying to guess my way through this Just don't get enough of me So now I need to clean my daughter's bed. I usually save hers for last since she does nap through the day, but I'm gonna take everything out and wash it and then also vacuum out the bottom. I have no idea how so much dirt and debris gets under her bedding. Just don't get enough.
but before I put the boy sheets back on I'm gonna take the seventh generation disinfectant and wipe down the mattress protectors I like to do this every now and then just to make sure they are thoroughly clean thankfully my kids don't have accidents anymore but I still love to have these on the mattresses in case of any unexpected accidents like stomach bugs that I mentioned earlier you say it's tired you don't want to fight but I've been wondering if everything's all right you say you love me and that's all fine but it's like I'm missing the passion in your eyes am I right Miss Ray had fun with a marker on my nightstand earlier today. Thankfully, it was washable, so a wipe right off, but when I first saw it, I low-key panicked. I'm gonna run the vacuum over my floor real quick, and then I want to freshen the rug with a quick shampoo. I get lots of questions about my carpet cleaner, so I'll have it down below. It's been a great one, and I've had it, I think, going on two years now. Alright guys, so it is the next day. I just got back with the groceries. It's still pretty early in the morning. I dropped the boys off at school this morning and then went on to get my grocery order. Um, so this is a pretty small haul. I just needed some things for some crock pot meals that I have coming up. Um, but we also needed things like bread and milk and stuff like that and some more produce. So um, just a small little fill-in haul. So right here I got some baby spinach. I also got some yellow onion uh, right here I got a head of cabbage some potato gnocchi um, back here I had ordered a gallon of organic whole milk but they substituted with two of these um, and did you guys know that organic milk has like a month or two expiration date you can see here this goes out on October the 10th. I did not realize that until a couple of weeks ago 
somebody was telling us and so I went and looked at our milk in the fridge and it had like a month or two expiration I can't remember how far out it went but it was a crazy long time compared to regular milk I think with regular milk you might have like a week or two um, but with organic it's like two months it's crazy I did not know that so let me know in the comments down below if you knew that um, I had ordered some raw shrimp but they gave me cooked I can still work with this I just would prefer to have um, the raw shrimp because I'm gonna be using it in the crock pot um, it's okay I'll just have to put it in closer to the end I got some meatballs um, a thing of V8 juice. Let me make sure that's the right blend. Yeah, original. Um, I already showed you the onions and the cabbage. I got some grapes. Um, we got some more blueberries. And then this. I thought I ordered the regular smoked sausage, but I got this. I don't know if I ordered it or if they gave it to me by mistake. Um, either way, I'm going to be making a soup with this. Maybe it'll taste good. We'll see. Um, I think I already showed you the potato gnocchi. If not, there's the potato gnocchi and then some bread. You only call me on the weekends. I'm going to go ahead now and wash the grapes and blueberries. I got a new colander I was excited to use. It's all about the little things. But what I do to wash my produce is I fill my sink about half full and then I pour in about a cup of white vinegar and I let it soak for 15 to 20 minutes. While that's soaking, I'm gonna make some overnight oats. I did three different kinds today. They were basically all the same. I just changed them up and did one with chocolate chips, one with white chocolate, and then I did one without any chocolate. But that's the beauty of overnight oats is you can make them how you like. And my kids really enjoy these for breakfast and snack. So I use old fashioned oats and today I just added chia seed, flax seed, honey, and brown sugar and they're absolutely delicious. I don't eat oatmeal, but I love overnight oats cold out of the refrigerator. So I'm gonna put this into the refrigerator and they are ready in four hours, but they can sit in the fridge for up to five days.
very last thing I'm going to do is start the yogurt. I like to do this in my pressure cooker. I'll leave the recipe and directions down below, but it's the easiest, most delicious yogurt recipe. But that is going to wrap up today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a butterfly emoji in the comments so I'll know you made it this far. Thank you again to FabFitFun for sponsoring this video. Be sure to use my code Kelly's Corner to get $10 off your first box. I hope you all have an amazing day and I'll see you next time. Bye.